Now, your flash briefing from Channel 3 Eyewitness News, sponsored by Ion Bank, your financial services partner. Thanks for joining us. I'm Kevin Hogan. The governor's office released the latest numbers of the coronavirus in our state. Here's a look right now. There are over 24,000 people in our state who have tested positive for COVID-19. More than 1,800 people have died. Hospitalizations have dropped again in Connecticut, this time by 67. Meanwhile, several state parks closed due to capacity, but also so did state boat launches. The state's waterways surely will entice boaters and people wanting to fish and observe wildlife. At state boat launches, a sign outlines how to maintain social distance in the age of COVID-19. Gatherings of more than five people are not allowed, and people should leave the ramps quickly during launching or retrieving. Parking at boat launches are only for people boating, fishing, or wildlife observation. And if you're not doing any of those things, you will be asked to leave the area. A second Connecticut prison inmate has died after contracting the coronavirus. The 57-year-old inmate was at the Willard Cybulski Correctional Institution in Enfield. He began showing symptoms on April 14th and was being put into a quarantine unit for testing when his condition worsened. The DOC says the man suffered from a pre-existing medical condition and he passed this morning at Johnson Memorial Hospital. On Friday, the department said to date it had 357 inmates as well as 282 staff members who had tested positive for the coronavirus. And we ask you to stay with Channel 3 for the very latest on the coronavirus outbreak. We'll have up to the minute developments both on air and on the Channel 3 app. Rain is on its way slowly through the day tomorrow. So your forecast tonight, we'll just notice an increase in cloud cover, but no rain will come yet. We'll see temperatures tonight going into the 40s, around 44, for instance, for Hartford. Tomorrow will be a lot cooler than today was. Instead of 60s, we'll only have highs in the upper 40s and lower 50s. We will have cloudy skies, and especially during the afternoon, we'll have either rain showers or periods of rain. And we'll see those scattered showers of rain lingering into Monday as well. And Monday, too, will be cool with highs in the 40s to near 50 inland, 52 along the shore. Tuesday and Wednesday offer sunshine with highs going back into the 60s. Watch Eyewitness News for the latest updates. This is your personalized flash briefing, sponsored by Ion Bank, your financial services partner.